goes into panic mode after Trump promises to expose one of America's greatest secrets. Since Donald Trump was elected president last November, the political establishment has been in a constant of panic. Trump's presidency is a harsh referendum to the shady politicians that have been in power for a better part of the last 50 years. For years, the American people have grown to distrust their government after numerous scandals have been pushed to the side to protect the deep state. During Trump's campaign, he promised the American people that he would be working for our best interests and that he would drain the swamp of corrupt individuals in Washington, D.C. Now, the CIA, a government entity in the United States that is notoriously shrouded in secrecy is panicking after Trump threatens to reveal one carefully guarded secret that could topple the establishment for good. There are many excellent reasons why the American people distrust the American government, and for a good cause. For years, the American people have been used as pawns to further the globalist agenda of a socialist state and to witness dozens of corrupt politicians walking free never answering for crimes they have committed. Though there has been one particular crime that was committed on American soil that has fascinated millions of Americans for decades. When beloved President John F. Kennedy was assassinated on November 22, 1963, Many people did not buy the official story of a lone gunman being responsible for the horrendous tragedy. Of course, there was an investigation into the John F. Kennedy's assassination but, many Americans felt it left more questions than answers. After the investigation concluded, the documents about the murder were locked up and never to be seen by the American people for over 50 years. Now, after decades. President Trump has announced that he will be allowing the release of all remaining classified documents, which are 3,000 in total, and all related to the JFK assassination to the public. And, of course, the CIA is in a state of panic and doing their best to thwart the release of these documents to the people. Infowars interviewed Roger Stone, and he stated that a reliable source close to him said that the Central Intelligence Agency CIA Director Mike Pompeo was lobbying hard for Trump not to release the documents to the public. However, this is where it gets interesting, and when you are dealing with the government, it always does. Many government officials claim that the documents on the JFK assassination will not reveal anything new, but then why are they fighting so hard to keep them a secret? According to Stone, he believes that it will paint the CIA in an unfavorable light by proving that Lee Harvey Oswald was trained by the CIA to pull off the crime of the century. Here is more from WPTV. President Donald Trump said Saturday he intends to allow the release of classified government documents about the assassination of President John F. Kennedy subject to the receipt of further information. Trump's tweet comes as he is staring down an October 26 deadline set in law by Congress mandating the public release of the still-secret documents, including FBI and CIA files, barring any action by the president to block the release of certain documents. Subject to the receipt of further information, I will be allowing, as president, the long-blocked and classified JFK files to be opened, Trump said appearing to leave open the possibility that some documents could still be withheld. The White House said in a statement to Politico earlier this week that the White House was working to ensure that the maximum amount of data can be released to the public by next week's deadline. Trump himself is no stranger to the controversies and conspiracy theories that have long swirled around the assassination of the 35th president. During the 2016 campaign, Trump made the unfounded claim that the father of GOP rival Senator Ted Cruz was associated with Kennedy assassin Lee Harvey Oswald, a claim he has never reneged nor apologized for. Trump's longtime political adviser Roger Stone, who helped launch Trump's campaign for president, is also an avid conspiracy theorist who wrote a book about the wild claim that President Lyndon B. Johnson, Kennedy's vice president, was involved in Kennedy's assassination. Republican members of Congress, including Senate Judiciary Committee Chairman Chuck Grassley, of Iowa, have urged Trump to allow the full release of the documents. No reason to keep hidden anymore, Grassley tweeted earlier this month. Time to let American PPL plus historians draw on conclusions. Historians who have studied the assassination did not believe the documents will lead to any bombshell new conclusions in the Kennedy assassination, 
but the documents could shed more light on facets of the investigation and Oswald's mysterious trip to Mexico City weeks before the assassination. Some have expressed concerns that the documents could be embarrassing to Mexico and damaging to U.S.-Mexico relations. What those documents will reveal is anyone's guess, but it cannot be good considering how hard government agencies are working to downplay this massive release. Will we finally have the answers we have all been looking for, or will it be so heavily redacted that it will lead to more questions than answers? Either way, this is a huge development and the deep state is obviously nervous which can only mean they are hiding something. Hiding something.